Let's see how our campsite looks from the morning. Wow! That's so pretty. So much so my Do you hear the birds? The birds were chirping since 5 a.m. but I love it man. Oh my god, this is just an amazing campsite, man. Amazing. There's something about the sun that shines on those leaves and the leaves slowly dance with the wind that's really healing It's been nice living here. The tree is slowly dancing with the wind. This is really what they call forest therapy, where you want to immerse yourself. I was so tired last night, I fell asleep, and I kind of woke up like 5 a.m. because I heard at least three, maybe five different species of bird. They were just chipping away at five. I didn't take out my earplug because it felt like those white noise, you kind of enjoy it. So I didn't do anything and I just tried to continue to sleep. And then the bird chipping, I think, stopped in an hour or two, or maybe I fall asleep in an hour or two. I don't know which one's first. You can still hear the bird chirping now, but the one I heard at 5 a.m. as I checked the time, it was so much louder and so much more variety. Like, 5 is their wake-up time. I feel like there is a community meeting, and they probably talk about what they should do today, what should they eat, where they should hunt, for instance. Or at least that's what I imagine they were talking about. whole morning is for this moment. Sitting in the forest, have a coffee, and enjoy my bakery.
the time slowed down here. I feel like I'm no longer rushing for anything. Ah, I think I'm going to sit here and read it. Let's see if the sun shines on the trees. 这么美好的瞬间。I'm not full from this, but I guess that's it for now, and I'll continue to eat when I get to my next destination. Hey. I finished all my coffee and milk and waffle. I think we're gonna get ready to move. Too rough and it was too bumpy. We're on like pull off. We're going to kind of rest a little bit. This is a good thing about having our home. We can just get to a pull off, rest, recharge, figure out our direction, and then keep going. Try to make this mapo tofu elver rice. I'm on a slanted surface, and my water pump is not working right. So I'm a little scared the water pump have issue because it was too bumpy. After we eat, we're gonna try a flat surface and see. So supposedly I should put the rice over here. It's too much rice. At room temperature, water to the rice until it's covered. Okay, pour the tofu vegetarian meat seasoning to the other side. At room temperature, water to the tofu until it's been covered. This is tofu. I'm a little worried about this tofu. It feels like plastic. I feel like I'm eating very unhealthy food here. I need to eat a lot of、um, vitamin after this. Oh, I still have egg and spicy chicken from yesterday. But let me cook this first. The plastic of self-heating bag. Put it into the lower layer. Add cold water until it submerged the self-heating bag, and then put the cover and let it sit for 15 minutes. All right, let's do that. This is the self-heating bag. I said I just have to add water and submerge it. <laughs> Water pump is not working the best. I'm a little worried, and it has this weird sound. There's a weird smell that just came from this. Really weird smell. Timer for ten minutes. The 
this will turn out surprisingly not bad. I have the chicken from yesterday and I have rice egg. This is my life. I'm going to enjoy the view and have lunch and worry about my potential broken water pump later. Bon appetit! Yesterday, there was sun and there was rain. Beauty in the mundane. And as the light startled our eyes, we let go of disguise. And now, there's something in the air and a sparkly shimmer. I am happy to announce that the water heater, sorry, the water pump is not broken. It was exactly what I suspected. I was on a slanted surface and I'm almost out of water. So probably the angle that I was trying to pump from didn't have too much water left. And now I'm leveled, it pumps fine. But this is a good view. So let me open the back door and uh, let's take a look there. So windy. Let's sit down. Let's sit down. Oh, but it's really beautiful. Sit. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy. Oh. Ah, 姐姐进去了，要不然风太大了。Oh, you're so cute. Okay, so this door does open all the way. I first time learned that. And it closed all the way. That's good. I think I'm just insecure, thinking a lot of things are gonna break with the RV. If this pillow just fell off and blew away. So now I'm going to go on trail. I don't know if I can see Elk anymore. It's already 4 p.m. I'm super late. I'm just procrastinating all day because Probably I know I'm gonna be in the sun and I'm going to be walking for a long time and I'm out of shape so I'm procrastinating it. Oh my god, this gotta be the most gorgeous trail. To my left is ocean. We haven't seen elk yet, but this is already not too shabby. It's so freaking beautiful. My head is ugly, but that's besides the point. I gotta see, this is insanely beautiful. The only worry is my dog, Tantan. It's already 15 minutes. 
I gotta hurry up. It's super windy, I don't know if you can hear me, but 30 minutes into the trail, I spotted my first couple of elks. Let me see if my camera is good enough to zoom in so you can see. So this camera can go 8x, but it's kind of shaky because I'm using my hand to stabilize against the wind. But it looks like this elk is having a good time. Others are all sitting and taking a nap. Oh, first time I see these, man. I want to see you for many, many years. First time. Oh, there is one in the back, also standing and eating grass. And if you see to their back here, there is more water. And they're just hanging out here in the valley. I just met another hiker. And he said, another five minutes, there's 20 more elks. So I will keep climbing. Look, I've been going uphill for all this time. Hopefully Tantan is okay. After I see these 20 more elks, I'm gonna head back. Hello! <laughs> Hi! Hello! Hello! I'm Ariel! Wow, you're so cute! Hello This gotta be the most beautiful trail I've seen in Bay Area. Also the most windy. There is ocean on both sides of the trail. We're gonna hurry back and check Tan Tan. Hopefully he's good. If you guys know any solution for cameras in the van, please comment. This line is what I'm going to take to go back. And we're back. There is my car. It looks okay. I see him on the little window. Oh, he's waiting for me. Um, it's 6.30 now. I'm back in the van. Tan Tan is very tired and we're probably gonna start heading home soon. Hey darling, can I tell you what's been on my mind? Overall, love the trip. There's just so many amazing things here in Northern California. Hey darling. Because I really like to watch vlogs of people traveling and I realize this earth has so many places that are beautiful. Everywhere has its beauty. We just have to discover it. Pack our, bags and get in that car. our Yula life. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a little note and we'll drive real far. Let's get out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside. We'll so see you in the next one. With the and thanks for being here. Peace. I see these pigeons or birds. They seem to wear a crown. Originally, I thought they all have an insects or their food that they were chewing, but no, they just wear a crown by default. How cute! <laughs> Love